What are you looking at? Objective is secured, sir. Good work, soldier. Make sure the Gek is secured aboard my Vertibird. Yes, sir. I'll have the text come down and remove it immediately, sir. You're certain he's unharmed? Yes, sir. He'll pass out shortly, but we can revive him. Excellent. Prepare him for transport immediately. Right away, sir. So, you're awake. Let's keep this nice and simple. You're going to tell me the code for that purifier, and you're going to tell me now. I'll tell you what's going on here. You lost. The good guys won this one, and now we're just wrapping up loose ends. We've got the purifier. Now we just need the code to start it. You're going to give me that code now and save us all a lot of trouble. Maybe I'll even let you go. So how about it? I'll be honest. I'm running out of patience here, and I'm not looking to play games with you. You tell me that code, or it's going to cost you... Why do you insist on provoking me? Tell me the code now. Colonel, I have need of you. Mr. President, I have no time for other matters. I'll be with you shortly. Now, Colonel. Yes, sir. Ah, alone at last. I do apologize for Colonel Autumn's attitude. He's been under a great deal of stress lately. I've no doubt that you know who I am. I'm sure you've heard my radio broadcasts. I'd like to have a word with you face to face. I think there are a few things that you and I should discuss. You'll find your possessions in the locker near the door. I'll unlock the way for you. And I'll unlock your restraints as well. I'll be waiting for you in my office. Please don't carry. Hold it right there. You're supposed to be in that holding cell. You're not going anywhere. There's a full complement of guards in the next room. As soon as I get them, you're going back to your cell. In a body bag, if necessary. On whose authority? I have no records of that. You're supposed to be in a holding cell. What? No one sees the president except Colonel Autumn. Stand right there while I check this out. 
Uh, Mr. President, I'm sorry to bother you. Uh, this is Lieutenant Williams. I have an unauthorized individual here who says he's supposed to speak with you. I'm surprised to hear from you, Lieutenant. I don't recall authorizing you to contact me directly. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm sorry about that. I, I just... Uh, it just seemed out of the ordinary. I apologize. Apology noted, Lieutenant. Yes? I instructed our friend to come up to the control room. No questions, no interference. Am I understood? I understand, sir. Again, I apologize for the interruption. Now, operate pass and report to your superior for reassignment, Lieutenant, at once. Yes, sir. They're not who they say they are. Get out while you can, before they get you too.
You're not supposed to be in here. What are you doing here? They... they captured me. Brought me here from Project Purity. I didn't want to help them at first, but... the technology they have here... it's so far advanced from anything I've worked with. Of course. You've seen the kind of technology these people have. They want to help people. They want to change the wasteland. I couldn't pass up an opportunity to work in an environment like this. Look, it's not personal. Really, it's not. But Dr. Lee, she's scraping by. She's scavenging for parts in the wastes. The Enclave has everything it needs. They're light years ahead of anything Dr. Lee could accomplish. Working here is my best chance to help make the world a better place. I'm sorry you see it that way. What are you going to do? Kill me over it? You should go. It sounds like you're in enough trouble as it is. And honestly, I don't want anyone to see me talking to you.
face to face at last. It's high time we met. I'm quite pleased you were able to make it. The trip was not what I had intended, but serves as an adequate test of your abilities. You're too kind. The pleasure is mine, I assure you. I've been anxious to make your acquaintance for some time. You and I have much to discuss, my young friend. Our nation's capital is at a crossroads. The path that you and I choose here today will affect us all. I need you to act on my behalf to ensure that our country's future is secured. My abilities to influence the world are limited at this time. I alone can only do so much. You, however, May come and go as you please. You have a greater degree of freedom. Perhaps it's best if I explain why things need to change, and why I'd like you to act on my behalf. Our land is ravaged by mutation. The war was so many years ago, and yet we still suffer from its effects. We cannot move forward until humanity can gain a solid foothold in the world. To do so, we must rid ourselves of the mutations that have plagued us for so long. These super mutants, ghouls, hideous creatures. I believe your father's work can do that in a way unlike any other. The purifier your father helped create has the ability to provide clean water to the whole of this capital wasteland. With a simple modification, it can be used to distribute agents that destroy mutated creatures upon ingestion. In time, we could eliminate all mutations in the wasteland. At the same time, the good people of the world regain their health. I need you to make the modification necessary for this to succeed. In front of you will be a vial of modified FEV virus. It can be inserted into the control console for the purifier. Doing so will inject it into the water supply, and the purifier will take care of the rest. You just need the code to activate the purifier. Simple, isn't it? It's an unusual request, one I wouldn't make if it weren't of the utmost importance. Please understand that I cannot allow you to leave until you've taken the vial. I'm afraid I won't be persuaded. Whatever powers you may have over the average wastelander are ineffectual on me. Really, do go on. Is our nation really in a state to be holding public elections? I think not. Once we have re-established ourselves and brought civilization to the land around us, then we can return to the old world policies. Because unlike humans, I am infallible. Because I've been programmed to be, of course. Processing. Internal logic error detected. Resetting primary memory circuits. Please stand by. Perhaps, well, perhaps there is a problem. I, I am unsure how to proceed.
rising command. New course of action dictated. Self-destruct sequence initialized. Civilian is advised to secure hazardous FEV material to prevent explosive decompression. Civilian also advised to evacuate complex immediately. Fascinating one at that. <laughs> Whoa, this technology is amazing. Imagine the evil that can be eliminated with such tools. I saw your capture, and a little cleverness allowed me to follow your captors. Uh, I only wish I could have arrived sooner to aid your escape. As I owe you my freedom, 
I felt it was only fair that I return the favor. After all, I know no one else in this world. My friend, I would be honored to follow a hero such as yourself. Shall we go? Something to say? Yes, by all means, let's. And I shall follow. <laughs> 